Welcome back, fuck boys and girls. Okay, so now that we know about Lavos, we have to go beat the shit out of him. But of course, we have a long game ahead of us because we need to build up the necessary strength to fight goddamn Godzilla. Oh, look at the thunder and lightning, so scary. Um, let's go ahead and head into the sewer access. This more or less is like a side quest area. There's not really much going on here besides that. Hey, that's that thing from Yu Yu Hakusho. Oh, beware of he eh? All right, bye. Fuck off. Oh, this music is so good. Oh, no! All right, fish men. Oh, it's using bubbles. <laughs> Frog will get that attack later on. Er, that's water. Interesting that it's a big bubble, but it's actually the magic spell water. Eighteen, you're a punk. Later. Gotta be stronger than that, son. You... <laughs> now we just got some frogs. <laughs> there was a bridge here. Alright, bye-bye, frogs. What? What is it with Chrono Trigger and frogs? Frogs have such a huge, like, part in this game. It's craziness. Uh, yeah, we're going this way first, yep. Oh, no! <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take out the merman first. You know who that looks like? That kind of looks like the merman that kills the dude in um, Cabin in the Woods. Yeah, 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 that movie, that movie was, it was solid. Well, hmm. That's a big swing movie. A lot of people say they like it, but then a lot of people do not like the way that movie like ends and turns out. Oh, Fire Whirl! Luca, no! You're so slow. Luca, girl, you gotta be faster. Oh, fuck it. Oh, Chrono, so beast. We're still... Wow, wow, these guys have kind of a lot of health. Yeah, these monsters in the future are way tougher than anything we've seen yet. I guess that makes sense. After Lavos destroys the world, they've had time to thrive. I love Chrono's victory celebration so much. What up? 600 G's? Eh. I'm okay with that. We need lots of money because... Gotta get all the characters heavily armored. Nothing over here. I, I love how when you try and go somewhere you can't go. Like, it usually just ends up with Chrono just shaking his head like, Nope. Can't do it. Can't do it. <laughs> Oh, Chrono, you kill me, man. Yeah, this is a scary, scary sewer for sure. Alright, but fuck it. Such a good soundtrack that Chrono Trigger has. Okay, so here we have a Resident Evil style, like, diary or document. I love this. Oh, the fishmen! Rather have my gums scraped. Oh, it's a shame you can't get it like an item so you can read it later on. Itchy, scratchy, itchy, scratchy. Okay, so this is pretty clear what happens here. You can walk by these little traps and you don't have to fight. But, oh, what an adorable little kitty. Oh, no! Yeah, this is gonna happen over and over. Of course, I can't help but fight all of these dudes. It's gotta happen. Get that cold stone creamery, creamery flavor. God damn it. Gotta have it. Why are they using lightning in a sewer? Alright, where is Fire World? Fuck you guys. And let's go ahead and heal Chrono. Oh, what up? Stupid mermen are no match for fire! 
<laughs> Stop shooting these damn bubbles! <laughs> Bitch! Wow, Chrono level up again already! Chrono, you just level up way too fast, man! This is a weird... So we've got... Looks like like a Coke can and a garbage can. Oh, never would have anticipated this. Although this this fight's not that bad because Chrono's going to be able to take out the top three with Fire World in about two seconds. Oh, I've really got to do something about Lucas' speed here. Later, Gators. Uh, I'm gonna save Marl's turn, and we're gonna use an Aura Whirl next turn, actually. These fucking near- How do you say it? Nearid? Or Nearid? These dudes really are getting on my nerves with all this magic they're using. Let's, uh, throw a Flame Toss at him. Wow, we are starting to get quite a bit of MP, like... I am safely able to use just tons of techs at all times and still have a huge reservoir of MP left. Oh, we got some cheese. What's up, cheese? Oh no, more monsters. I could I never would have guessed that they'd attack. Oh, god damn you, Luca. So I definitely could take out the rat and then that dude, and then I'll have Marl start attacking the uh, merman on the right there. Lightning is powerful. Take a seat. No more locked doors, you fucking dumbass merman. Oh, now this is so painfully obvious. Because you step on the save point and it does that little ding. Yep. Oh man, and these guys look they like they might just be out of range of a fire whirl. Are they? Let's see. Yeah, ain't that a motherfucker? All right, well we'll just start beating on them left to right then. Die, you dumb merman! Holy shit, they're... hmm. They're really strong. Or maybe it's just that Luca and Marl are very, very weak. And I'm gonna have to use another Aura Whirl. Oh, so many attacks coming from all angles. Fuck. Um, Luca, take him out, and then we'll have Chrono use an Aura Whirl. Oh, come on! I wanted to see your hammer! I wanted it to be motherfucking hammer time in this bitch! Hammer time! Oh, stupid bubbles constantly! Shove these fucking Sailor Moon Mercury bubbles back up your ass, you dumb merman! Thinking about it, that is that does suck for Sailor Mercury. So, like, Sailor Mars is busting out, like, fire, and Sailor Jupiter's got, like, super awesome thunder and lightning. And then, like, Mercury just has, like, fucking bubbles. Like, Mercury bubble? That's garbage. She does- her attack- all it does is make the room foggy, too. She's never actually really attacking anything with it. That sucks. Poor Sailor Mercury. She gets the short end of the stick, for sure.
Oh my god, the fucking purple goo. Although they are in perfect order for Chrono to just go slash a Ruski here. Oh, Chrono! Good job, Luca. Leveling up. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. And nothing else here. Hmm. What do we got? Nothing. Ba -da -da. The music in this game is so oh good. Go around back and press the switch. Well, I can see the switch right there, so let's do that shit. Kablamo! Chrono! Nothing over here. Down there, down there. No, stop shaking your head at me. I know it's here somewhere. There it is. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Fuck! This labyrinth like maze. Hey, Mr. Froggy, what's up? So you press the switch and all the bridges will open. Okay, that's no problem at all. I'm perfectly okay with that. Ribbit! Wait, I don't understand. So he can't reach the switch and then he goes, So you call yourself a frog? Why, yes, I do call myself a frog because I am a fucking frog. Oh, interesting. That's the first area. Okay. What do we got right here? Rage Band. Oh, yes. This is nice. I believe this is uh, Counter Attack. Now, I did say I was going to keep the speed belt on Chrono for all time, but having him Counter Attack actually will be a huge advantage. And at the same time, we can make Luca faster. Yes. Excellent. Uh, let's make sure everyone's all healed up, too. Yeah. <laughs> Marl has plenty of MP left. Damn, girl. You still gotta level up, though. You're only level 10. Oh, hello. Is your name Sir Crawley? Sure is. Must have a death wish. Hey, 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 no Charles Bronson around here, motherfucker. Well, hey, we're, we're standing right here. Hello. Hello, we're... Stop laughing. <laughs> why why do they just keep laughing even harder? <laughs> Yo, fuck you too. He just fucking bounces. I love it. He's just like, whoa, fuck this. I love how there's no dialogue with Luca, Marlo, Chrono. We just instantly get into a fight. Alright, so we are gonna definitely be throwing out Fire Whirl. Oh, wait, I definitely know Chrono needs to be healed after this. Ah, 201. Oh, yes, Chrono counterattack. I fucking love it. So, old Sir Crawley here, he has an attack that lowers us down to one health. Uh, we're just gonna be pounding out Fire Whirl. And let's go ahead and heal Chrono again. Yeah, bosses at the beginning of Chrono Trigger are kinda just like... Spam dual techs. Play smart. Maybe you could say that's what bosses are like in any game. Cause, oh, this dude, he's kind of a boss, Sir Crawley. I mean... Yeah, I'm gonna label him a boss. Oh, yeah, he has a boss, boss death animation, so I'm gonna label him a boss for sure. Only bosses die like that. So Sir Crawley was a boss. Even though he didn't have boss music, that's okay. I don't hold it against you, Sir Crawley. You're still a boss in my heart forever. What else we got going down? 
Oh no, more slime oozmen. They are in prime position to get fucking Fire World back to hell. Luca, you slow ass bitch. Oh my god, the Rage Ban was such a good idea. That will help out so much. Die, you damn pucus, mucus egg sacks. Aha! Don't go for Chrono, bitch! Because you end up dead. One more hit! Come on, come on, come on! Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> and I love how Marl just hovers in, in midair for like five seconds. Marl has the crazy power of flight. What do we got here? Bolt sword! Fuck yes! Fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah! Let's go ahead and equip this bolt sword to make Chrono, the fucking beast, even stronger. Not bad. Raise the strength by an additional three. I'll take it. Chrono, why you so cool? Chrono, the fucking beast. That's cool. That rhymed, kinda. Okay, so now that we flip that switch, all the bridges are extended all over the place. So we can easily just leave. Yeah, this is the exit right here. But we're gonna go through the other end. Where does this go? Oh yeah, back to this place. Which obviously we do not need to fuck around. Oh my god, no! Yeah, bitches. Ah uh, yeah, this was the bolt sword. Empty, cause we got that shit. Okay, now this will spit us out on the other continent. So interesting that that was a sewer access that went under the fucking ocean. Uh, let's actually go ahead and head to Death Peak. This is actually, like, the very last, uh, story dungeon we'll go through. Like, spoiler alert, way at the end of the game. We can't really do much here now. Uh, you'll see why in a second. But we can sprint our asses up here. And get a power tab! And that's why, because every time we try and go in here, we just get blown right the fuck off the mountain. I'll, I'll show it one more time. But, obviously we're able to run in and grab that power tab before the wind blows us off. Yeah, we're gonna make it! Nope, not quite. Death Peak is such a different area from the rest of the future, too. Very interesting. Um, let's go ahead and use that power tab, though. We'll make Chrono even stronger! Excellent. Yeah, look at Chrono. 23 power, and then Luca and Marl at 4 and 7. Terrible. But obviously, like, Marl, her main purpose right now is as a healer. And Luca's kind of like our magic attacker with the flame toss. Some more good Chrono Trigger music here. Nothing. No info for us, huh? Oh, wow, that's a weird... Yeah, that's, what a weird area. Wait. Oh, I see. Okay. I was like, what the fuck? No, we come over here, and then over here. Hello! Oh, Shayla! Oh, shit. Obviously, Shayla. Shayla's theme. That's the awesome music track in this game. Oh, do not climb Death Peak. Has to be the right time. Okay. 
Ocean Palace and the Blackbird. Well, those just might be dungeons in the future we have to go through, but who am I to know? Oh, that's it, so you just recycle through the same dialogue. So this dude obviously is important to the story somehow. Final program code. Oh, back to work, slave. Damn. All right, and then of course, can't do anything here. Some unknown power keeps us the fuck away. What a damn shame. Nothing and nothing, okay. So now we are completely done on this end of the continent. Um, basically, the main reason to go through the sewer access, we wanted to get the Rage Band and the Bolt Sword, and then obviously that power tab on Death Peak there. Now we're going to go ahead and head to that time gate so we can head back to the present, as Luca said, because she wants to gather more info on Lavos. Even though I don't know why we're going to find more info on motherfucking Lavos in our time period. Why do I keep checking this chest even though I know it's empty? Wait, one more time. Empty. Who would have ever thunk it was empty? Sorry, guys. I've already fought a lot. Ba, 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 ba. Lavos, here we come to fuck your day up. And we've already been over here, too. Okay. Sewer access later. And what do we have here? Ooh, Lab 32. Let's do it. Although, you know what? Actually, um... Hmm. I'm gonna go back to this other dome and rest in the Enertron. Get my MP back, because I know Chrono's MP has got to be getting pretty low by this point. Because Maro and Luca, like Flame Toss and Aura, only cost one for them. But Cyclone costs two for Chrono. And Chrono has less MP than Luca and Marl anyway. Alright, wait, you're the shop, right? No. Excuse me, fuck out of my way. Uh, Enertron. <clears throat> I'm thinking maybe I'll buy an extra, like, armor or helmet, but nah. I'm just gonna save all my money for, um, upgrades in the future. I'm just gonna save before we go in the- Actually, you know what? I'm not allowed to bypass save points. So, let's go ahead and save. Oh wait, fuck, can't I just press X and it'll take me directly to the save menu? Let me check that real quick. Yep, okay. That is a shortcut. Uh, we will go ahead and save on this free block right here now. Beyond the Ruins, still. Wow, we are on Beyond the Ruins for a long ass time. Multiple boss battles, crazy mini games, all type. Hey, Don, what's up? More powerful robots! But the robots are scary! Not really, because we have Rage Bands, motherfucker. Bolt Sword. Power Tab, so Chrono's even more powerful than before. I sure hope we never lose Chrono from the party, because he's just way too fucking beast! They can't handle him! Alright, Lab 30 Dose, let's do it. What do we got here? Mid tonic. Empty. Thanks for the mid tonic. -na 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 -na. -na 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 -na. So now that we have the key, we can go ahead and get in this car. Oh no, more proto twos. Let's go ahead and whip their asses. Your fat asses, let's do it. Oh, listen to this groovy music here. The man, what up? I love how his name is now The Man. <laughs> the man! Okay, Johnny. Uh, bike race. Oh, let's do it. No, bitch. I'm gonna take you the fuck down. Do I know how to ride? Yes, I do. It's not hard. Let's fucking whip his ass. Let's go, Johnny. Alright, so this is super duper easy. 
Um, all you gotta do is just press, uh, circle to boost. And you can, like, kind of go up and down and... Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 trying to block me off. This isn't really a race as much as it's just, like, right near the end, you just have to make sure you use your boost correctly so you can cross the finish line before Johnny here. Oh, the tension is mounting. I don't want to blow it. Yeah, what up, Johnny? Can't fuck with me. Dun, 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 dun. Look at this. Look how fucked up the future is. This shit is crazy. Come on, Johnny. You can't handle me, motherfucker. Not even Johnny Sins could beat me in a race. What the fuck is up? Oh, he's so sad. He's like, I don't get it, the fuck, man? Sorry, Johnny. I am too beast. Oh, wait, hold on. There's something else in here. Uh, let's go through the middle here. Yeah, so there's like a kind of little bit of... Oh, Mr. Mutant... Holy shit, three mutants. Oh, god damn it. Maybe I should have just continued along with the story. Nope, fuck that. Gotta get my exploration on. Uh, we'll go for these. Come on. God damn it. I fucked up. Oh, that's bullshit. It definitely should have hit both of them. God damn it, you dumbass mutants. Please attack Chrono so we can speed this along. Oh, I should use Slash. Ah, and I like that uh, Chrono's Bolt Sword now. We can see that really beautiful little lightning energy coming out. No, Mario, don't get tentacle raped by it. We'll go ahead and have Chrono attack the top one since the bottom one has got to be close to death now. And look at Chrono. His, he's doing 90 damage now. Whoa, these dudes have way more health than I thought they were gonna. Oh, fuck, but I had Chrono attack the bottom one. That's a rookie miss. Oh, no, good, okay. Oh, wait, what? Oh, he countered the top one. All right, we, we're, we're good here. We're good. No, that was a hammer time, Luca. Damn you. Stupid mutants, get the fuck out of here. Alright, now there's a chest in here. I'm looking. Aha, there it is. More big ass me. Oh, god damn it. Oh, no, this is fine. A, a fire world is probably gonna take all five of them out. Or actually, it's called flame world. No, it's fire world. Wait, yes, there we go. I was thinking maybe Chrono's regular attack might damage them since he has uh, the bolt sword, but no. No such luck. Thank you very much. Wow, those guys give fucking shit experience. Race log, there we go. Alright, so the race log... This just keeps track of all the times that we fucking beat Johnny's ass. Yeah, we've got all our key items here. Pendant, bike key, gate key, race log. Thanks very much. Alright, let's continue exploring this fucking area. Oh no! The mutants! They're so ugly! And it looks like, like... That looks like an egg at the top, or is that supposed to be like their brain? Like they have a green brain. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm taking out of it. 
And Luca, go ahead and use a little fire on these bitch ass bitch boys. 74, so yeah, that's not really too much. Yeah, they know better. They're not attacking Chrono. They're like, fuck that. We know what that beast will do to us. <clears throat> fuck that. Oh, you dumbass. Oh, Chrono, come on, man. I know the counterattack rate is only 50%, but you gotta bust that out. Okay. Good. Morrow finally did catch up to us. Whoa, Chrono, he has way more experience than everyone else. Oh my god, these mutants just all day, every day. Go ahead, fuckboys. Let's do it. Although, they are definitely standing in Fire World territory. Don't fuck with me. Come on, Luca. Although, I kind of need to use an Aura World. Ah, right after this fucking beast-ass attack. Yeah! Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. So they are probably close to death. Uh, not really. Oh ho ho, attacking Chrono, are you? That's what you get. I'm actually gonna bust out an Aura Whirl first. And we'll have Luca finish it off with a Flame Toss. F you, you mutant! Still alive? Come on. Cool, cool. And then this will take us to the other end here. Yep. Johnny! You wanna... You wanna go again? Let's do it, Johnny! You can't fuck with me! Never, ever, ever can you beat me, Johnny. I'll get a boost right off the bat here on you, fuck boy. Ready? Boost, bitch! What up, Johnny? Alright. Johnny thinks he can fuck with me, but he certainly cannot. Whoa, that was actually kind of close there, Johnny. But you can't touch Chrono. Feel like I just beat a battle in Chrono Cross. F you, Johnny. Oh, you look so dejected. All right, later. Okay. So, we have the, uh, factory here. Now, there's not really much we can do with the factory at this moment in time. I like this music, it's kind of good. Yeah, nothing. Oh, -ho! but an enemy decides to say hello. Because we can see that little uh, laser blocking that path over there. This is probably a flame toss, dude, definitely. For some reason, acid is shooting fireballs at us. Let's ignore that. F you, you acid. Now, this is one of those dudes with really low health who has really low... Who takes really low damage. Although he sure is taking a ton of attacks. Damn. Yeah, I can't head up that way. And this laser blocking our path. So we'll have to come back later. Not a goddamn thing we could do about it. Okay, and what do we have here? 
the Proto Dome. Let's go ahead and drop a Savaru before we head and see what the F is going on in the Proto Dome.